I think we have this fear of not doing social media. What you could do is whatever you do for cold traffic, try to do it consistently. I don't have two clients who are doing the same strategy. If I were to be someone who'd be like, succeed on Instagram. Yes, there's a whole bunch of people who are going to succeed on Instagram, but not everybody's going to succeed on Instagram. I like to talk about social media, like the thumb on a hand. Thumbs make hands very useful, but alone, they don't do much. That's how I feel about social media. Alone, it's a pretty empty strategy. It's a support strategy for other things. If you do one post a week, that's cool. And then when money's coming in, you can hire someone to do it and it feels fun. Then yeah, it's like, it's backup, but it's not the main business. Think about it. There's billionaires who aren't on social media. Do the math, right? Yeah, it's, it's nice to have. have. You should have it. There's stages in business. And I think don't do it until it's easy and fun to do. And personally, there are paid people helping you. Trying to do it on your own is, is uh I don't think the money will come back. Certainly not for thoughtful, highly trained professionals. I find they are a little more cautious and do like to see thought leadership before they make a purchase. Thanks for coming, Sinead. Is that helpful or is there anything else you need? Yeah, that was helpful. Thank you. I think I was needing some validation. Do you have a question that you would like to ask me about your business? If yes, This is my official invitation for you to come to one of my free first Friday fireside chats for free coaching with me. The topics that I specialize in are authentic branding and marketing to grow your business. If you would like to come and join me and get help with your business, just click the link below and sign up now.